Let's set up your kitchen display system. You'll first need to make sure you have already plugged your kitchen display system into the same network that all your equipment is on. Then, log into your station using a manager pin on your SkyTab POS and navigate to the manager tab, followed by the settings tab, and then hardware section near the bottom. Finally, tap the printer's KDS tab at the top. If you have more than one KDS, you may see a SkyTab KDS configuration already created under this list. However, for this video, let's walk through how to set up a new KDS configuration. Start by pressing the Add New Device button. Now, give your device a name. For this video, we will use SkyTab KDS. Then if it's not already set to IP, click on the gray IP button and a text field will appear here. You will need to type in the IP of your kitchen display system. To find the IP of your kitchen display system, turn it on and check the lower right of the screen. Take note of the IP here. This is what you will need to type into the new device IP box. After that, you'll need to select SkyTab KDS from the device model drop-down menu. Press the Save button on the pop-up to be taken to your new device screen. Now select the Send Config button at the bottom right. Once sent, proceed with assigning all the items and modifiers you wish for this KDS to show. Depending on how your business is set up, you may have more than one KDS set up for different menu items. For this video, we are adding all of the items and all of the modifiers. Tap on Save once ready. Now let's go back to the Order menu and create a new ticket to test with. Click on Send, and the ticket should appear on your kitchen display system within seconds. If at any time you encounter any difficulties with setting up your kitchen display system, feel free to contact our 24-7 customer support.